In PwC Africa, we have a governance board, which is responsible for overseeing the approval and implementation of the strategic initiatives of the business of PwC Africa. PwC South Africa, which makes up about 70% in revenue and people of the overall of our business in Africa, has its own governing board, which supports the PwC Africa Governance Board in ensuring that the business plans and strategy is implemented in South Africa too. As a South African governing board, our role is to understand how these various sub-strategies of PwC Africa are linked to our purpose and to the bigger picture of what PwC wants to achieve in Africa, as well as understanding the links between these strategies. Both the governance and governing boards spend time on the firm's digital transformation strategies. Primarily, the governing board supports the governance board's role by focusing on four matters. The first one being overseeing the implementation of the strategies and business plans of PwC Africa as approved by the governance board in South Africa. Secondly, implementing the evaluations and compensation for the South African partners as approved by the Africa Governance Board. Thirdly, overseeing areas directly affecting South African partners, including but not limited to implementing decisions of the Governance Boards regarding admissions, withdrawals and removal of partners in South Africa. Lastly, overseeing the execution of the South African CEO's duties. The Governance Board is constituted in terms of the PwC Africa Joint Venture Agreement and the Governing Board is constituted in terms of the PwC South Africa's Firms Partnership Agreement which allows it to support the Governance Board. Several committees support the Governance and Governing Boards and are accountable to these boards. These committees report to the members at each board meeting. The Governance Board is made up of 12 members who are not involved in the day-to-day -day management of PwC Africa. In South Africa, other than the Chief Executive Officer, none of the Governing Board members serve as members of the South African Leadership Team. For the Governance Board, three key focus areas took precedence in the past financial year. The first was facilitating the appointment of the new Africa CEO. From the candidates producing their manifestos, vetting of candidates and assessing their presentations and managing and overseeing the voting process from a governance perspective. Secondly, dealing with the challenges associated with implementing a new business operating solution, BOSS system. And finally, the financial aspects associated with this implementation. For the Governing Board, its primary focus was supporting the Governance Board in these three areas and locally focusing on continued transformation of our business and ensuring that the firm's quality objectives are met. While the Africa Governance Board will continue dealing with issues around the Africa-wide implementation of the BOSS suite of technologies in PwC Africa, the South African Governing Board will be focusing on mandatory audit firm rotation and its impact on our local business. This, along with the recent corporate scandals, will inevitably impact the way we do business. And we need to be ready for the inevitable impact on our people and on our revenue. Quality remains non-negotiable, alongside employment equity and transformation. Firstly, feedback on the election process of the Africa CEO was good, in particular around communication and the governance board's independence. Secondly, both the governance and governing boards made holding management accountable one of our main priorities. As a professional services firm, integrity, independence and high standards of governance are expected. It's the role of the board to oversee management's implementation of the firm's business plans and strategy to ensure that this is indeed the case. 
We are always thinking about how to ensure that PwC fulfills its role of building trust in the market and society at large. And when things go wrong, we should also be brave and act swiftly to rectify them. It's about understanding our role and making sure we play it correctly.